In a world in which materialism has dominated and minds have become fascinated by sensualities, the doors of questioning the truth and the obvious have been opened, and the crashing waves of atheism have begun to knock on the doors of the Islamic world, targeting Muslim youth, repeating its old incessant question. Does Allah exist? And despite the fact that the existence of the Almighty and His Lordship over His creation is the brightest and most clear thing in existence, the signs of the Sharia and the signs of creation have come with the clearest evidence of His existence. Glory be to Him. The neediness that exists within the soul of every human being is sufficient evidence of His existence. Glory be to Him. This natural neediness is shown clearly during testing and difficult times when a person finds in himself the necessity to turn to Allah Almighty, call him and seek his help. Allah says, And when adversity touches you at sea, lost are all those you invoke except for him. But when he delivers you to the land, you turn away from him, and ever is man ungrateful. Surah Al-Isra, verse 67. The sound mind clearly accepts that everything created must have a creator and everything that happens must have someone who caused it. There is no creation without a creator and nothing happens without someone causing it. Allah says, or were they created by nothing or were they the creators of themselves? Or did they create the heavens and the earth? Rather they are not certain. Surah At-Tur Verse 35, 36. They are two possibilities that have no third. Either this unique and systematic creation is without a creator, and this is rationally impossible, or that the creation created itself and created the heavens and the earth. This is even more impossible, and no one has claimed this. Therefore this universe must have a creator, and that is Allah the Exalted. Whoever contemplates the sky its fastness and what's in it from the sun, moon, stars, planets and their alignment and accurate movement in this great astronomy, who contemplates the earth, the changing of night and day in a regular and precise order, the diversity of its inhabitants, the animals, the plants that are nourished with one water yet differ in taste, shape and colour, and contemplates the seas and the waves they contain and the wonders of creation, Whoever contemplates all of that is certain of the existence and power of the Creator, as he the exalted says. He covers the night with the day, another night chasing it rapidly, and he created the sun, the moon and the stars, all subjected by his command. Unquestionably his is the creation and the command. Blessed is Allah, Lord of the worlds. Surah Al-Araf, verse 54. The pulse of every heart the natural disposition of every living being, the evidence of the senses and the evidence of the mind all testify to the existence of a great wise creator who manages this universe. How strange! How can Allah be disobeyed? How can the deniers deny him? In every movement and serenity there is a witness for Allah. In everything there is a sign indicating that he is the one God.